Well, the weather forecast has promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. How do you see the match going, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And they know they need to stop him. That's right. Now, what can they do from here? Determined defending. It's a perfect challenge. Efejan Karadja. Kadioglu William Arau Ferdi Kadioglu Now can they make something happen? Could be! And the post denied him And the danger is averted High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Lusamba. Now he must favour the cross. Perfect example of how to put in a tackle, and a corner will be next. What about the opportunity from earlier? Let's have another look now, shall we? Now, how about the short corner? That's right. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good and he got better as the half wore on.
And the match is underway. And the danger is averted. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that. And it was close. Well, his skill level is so high. You're absolutely right. That's a great effort. So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Fair. Lusamba. A sloppy pass. Arau. It's with Batshuayi. Opportunity here. And it's gone in. The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, here's the goal again. And what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Lusamba. And snuffing out the danger. Well, I'm not surprised by those stats. Fenerbahce have controlled the flow of the game, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Yes, it might be on for them once more. And they'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. He's protecting it effectively. Jure Balkovets. In possession, Ahmed Hassan. Options in the centre. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Can they hit on the break? The high press was very much on. He's going forward well here. Could be! Oh, he's blocked it! Well, following the clearance, it will be a corner. Here it is now, a substitution. Trying to pick out a teammate. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Well, not giving him any breathing room. So a throw in here. Wilson Eduardo and Ferhat on the ball delivered into the area here well, didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done Ferdi Kadioglu it's with Michi Batshuayi and the counter looks on here options available and it looked like open road for them but up a dead end Physically strong and secure on the ball. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters. 
You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball, and then just a few mistakes at the back, and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. And I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so...